it's like, honey, look, this is gonna be a stripper. Like, you ready for this? <laughs> what are you willing to do? Oh, tell me what you're willing to do. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I am so happy to have you. And if you're returning, hey girl, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button, y'all. Let's be a family. Let's get into this video, okay? Because I got some dope stuff to show you. So, do you guys notice anything different? Hmm? Anything? Anything at all? Anything? 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 <laughs> I freaking dyed my hair again. I went for a more blonder Still. Yeah, what do you guys think? I love it. So right. let's get into this haul. So the first thing I want to show you, remember Adidas had those button up pants? So we all know those are back in trend. Everybody's looking for button up pants. Everybody's trying to sell button up pants. You can find them on AliExpress going in between 19 and up dollars. I found some for 13 but I heard the quality wasn't that great. And y'all know me, I'm a thrifter. So before I start buying it from retailers, I was like, let's look at the thrift store. So, I found these right here. These are Nike, you see the sign, they're Nike sweats. And these were $4.99. And um, these actually weren't half off because this is considered an orange tag. But I mean, five dollars for some Nike pants aren't bad at all. And they zipper up and down both ways. So this is like a spin off to the button up pants. This is the zip up pants. And these are still dope and fashionable, so yeah, slaying. Y'all, I stay in the thrift stores because we know cheap bitches be the richest. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you guys, as soon as I get done recording this video, I'm gonna strip, turn on my air conditioner and lay under my fan and just cool down because I be like dying trying to record these videos, got these videos for you guys so that it's not so loud in the background during my videos. I better thumbs up a girl for that, for dying in this heat for y'all. Like, that's love, honey. That's love. All right. So, here go some more pants. These don't fit, these are little kids pants, but these were $4.99 and this was half off because of the blue tag. So I got these for $2.50 and I only bought them to cut the um, button up piece off of it because I can use this. Sorry somebody, I'm um, sending me a message. So sorry. But so that I can use this like to make my own type of pants. So yeah. I know these don't fit, but I just bought these for the buttons. So we'll see what I do with these. If you're interested in that project, let me know and I'll show you. I don't need any more button up pants because, honey, I, I hit the jackpot at these thrift stores, okay? So these were $6.99 and I actually did pay $6.99 for these because these were not on sale. It was only blue, pink, and purple that was on sale. The tags and the super green. But, I mean, you can't beat $7 for some Nike button up pants. These are authentic, these are real Nikes, and they button up, but as you see, that fleece in there is too hot for this, so I'm going to have to wait until the fall to slay these, but this is a size large, so I did get a large in these pants, and look at that, y'all, $7 for some authentic Nike button up, like, yo, go check out your local thrift store for real, because you can save up so much money. Alright, so next is these button ups. These have no um, real designer. It's called East West. Never heard of them. Um, an extra large. So I got this an extra large. They're from a company called East West. Never heard of them. But guess how much they were, y'all? Three ninety nine, half off. So let's just say one fifty. If you want to round up and say these were four dollars, let's still just say two dollars for some button up pants. So y'all, who's gonna be lit this fall? Me, honey, because I've been dying to find the Adidas ones, the original, the black Adidas pants with the white um, stripes going down. Uh, my brother owned some back in the days, but foolish of us, we didn't think that. It's like, you know, when something goes out of trend, you just throw it away or give it away or something. That's what happened to him. I wish I would have kept them. But still, I still found the pants. And like, yes, like, honey, look, this is going to be a stripper. Like... You ready for this? <laughs> the next pair of pants I got, nothing special. They're just some plain Nike um, sweatpants or joggers, whatever you want to call them. Authentic Nike, $4.99. Got them for 
fifty. So yes, like some plain Nike pants. They have like the pink Nike word on it, and at the bottom it just has this little piece up here that opens the exposed this little white piece, or you can just close it to leave it regular. All depends on you. So yes, honey, I will be slaying in these like joggers and stuff. This All fall. right. So next, our last pair of button ups is these right here. And I think these are Nike as well. So yeah, I'm just going to be slaying at all these Nike button ups, okay? $8.99. So I did pay $8.99 for this because like I said, it was a green tag. So still, $9 for some button up Nike pants aren't bad. Kind of a replica of the Adidas because it is black and white with the stripe going. Except for it's Nike rather than Adidas. And they do button up all the way up and down. So look. Oh, and this is Nike Hoop. I'm not a hooper, but I'm going to be rocking these like I am. So I'm telling you, please go check the local thrift store. If you're looking for stuff that's on trend, especially stuff that's on trend now that's like used to be in trend back in the day, because you know, like they say, every decade um, we're replicating something from back in the day. So all we are doing is reliving the 80s and 90s and 2000s. Again, so check your local thrift stores because these are stuff that used to be in trend that you can find again for the low low. I'm telling you. Listen to what I'm telling you. You hear me? You feel me? You're listening? You're listening? Listen to what I'm telling you. Go check out your local thrift stores. All you gotta do is watch these bad boys and throw them on and nobody's gonna know where you got them from. And they're gonna be wondering, girl, where you get them from? And I mean, honey, they can't find it. You can tell them where you got it from, but they can't find it. Like, <laughs> they only sold that one in the thrift store and you got it. So, go check that out. There will be a trial haul. I will try to sell all of these uh, things I showed you guys and stuff later. Not now, because I'm dead. Like, I'm hot. I'm dying. I'm sorry, y'all. Y'all just don't have to be mad at me, but it's, it's just too damn hot. Like, I'm this choker is probably fogging up. Like, this choker got my neck feeling like butter. Like, makes no sense. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Did you guys enjoy this video? Are any of you guys sisters? If so, let me know. What is your favorite thrift store? The thrift stores I went to are my local thrift store, so I went to um, the Salvation Army thrift store, um, and that's a real big thrift store, y'all. Like, you guys really got to see that thrift store. Um, it's a it's a thrift store called Second Avenue Chance or Second Chance Avenue, something like that, and a Goodwill. So those are the three thrift stores I visited that all these items in this haul came from. If you have your favorite thrift stores where you live, let me know, and maybe I can look them up and see if the state that I'm in has them. If not, let's believe I'm so mad when I was in um, Vegas and Cali, I didn't get to go thrifting. I want to go thrifting in every state that I visit because every state has something different. So yeah, I, I really can't really, I can't wait to go back so I can start thrifting um, in different states and stuff. But yeah, did you guys enjoy this haul? Let me know. What was your favorite item? What was your least favorite item? Like, for real, y'all, go hit the thrift store. It's like, bad and bougie doesn't mean, you know, your price tag gotta be high. You can be bad and bougie and your whole outfit could cost, like, $10 for real. And you can still be bad and bougie because you're still bougie and you still look bad as fuck. Okay. So, <laughs> thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. What was your favorite item? What are your favorite thrift stores? Um, let me know if you want me to actually vlog myself thrifting because... I could spend hours in thrift stores and like never get bored. So let me know. Do you want to see me thrift? If so, I will learn how to vlog it because I record on my iPad. Um, once I get the money, I will buy a vlogging camera. But for right now, I do vlog um, and record everything on my iPad. So I will figure out how to do that. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Until next time. Bye, guys.